The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen only mode. Hello guys, welcome to the free Salesforce career guidance by Intelogic. And uh, let us start today's session by to learn your uh, today's interview question related topic for Salesforce. So in this uh, today's lesson, we will have the part number nine of Salesforce real time scenario based interview questions. Let us see what is going to be the first question plus also how to answer this kind of questions in the interviews. Let us see one by one. So let's start the first question. If data is present in the object, then can we create master detail relationship? So when the data is present, then we cannot create master detail relationship on that directly. So first of all, we have to create lookup relationship between these two objects and then we need to convert into the master detail. To be precise, first of all, we need to create lookup relationship between them. Then actually we need to ensure that all the child records have the parent records connected and then we need to convert into the master detail relationship. This is the approach you can follow and explain in the interview. Let's start the next question. What is the need of junction object in Salesforce? So we need junction object in Salesforce specifically when we want a uh, many to many relationship to form. So whenever in the Salesforce project, we have a requirement to form many to many relationship. We need a third object to ensure that we can replicate this uh, phenomenon. So for that purpose, junction object is required. That should be your answer in the interview. Let's go for the next question. Can we convert master detail into lookup relationship? We can convert master detail into lookup relationship for sure. Not a problem. But uh, for that purpose, we need to ensure that there is no role of summary field available. No role of summary field should be present. Then it's possible. Next question. Can we delete junction object? So we can delete the junction object. Not a problem. And uh, for that purpose, we need to ensure that there are no dependencies. We need to just cross check that once. And this way we can delete the junction object. No problem and uh, by following all these steps okay now let's go for the next question can we delete users in salesforce we are not having the authority to delete the users because that can collapse the system and integrity of the dependency a user can have in salesforce projects that's why we cannot delete a user in salesforce so this should be your answers guys in the interview and uh, this way you can explain and give the presentation of your knowledge in the Salesforce. Let's connect again in the part number 10. Till then, have a good luck for your interviews.